In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Most Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, I adore Thee profoundly. I offer Thee the most precious body and blood, soul and divinity of Jesus Christ present in all the tabernacles of the world in reparation for the outrages, sacrileges, and indifferences by which He is offended, and through the infinite merits of His most sacred heart and of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I beg of Thee the conversion of poor sinners. Amen. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love Thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love Thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love Thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love Thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love Thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love Thee. Sancti Michael Archangeli, defendi nos in predio, contra nequitiam et insidias diaboli esto presidium, imperitiri Deus supices de precamor, tuque princeps minitiae celestis, Satana maniosque spiritus manignos, quod perditione manimarum pervagantur in mundo, divine virtute in infernum de trude. Amen. Our Lady of the Rosary, pray for us. As we prepare to enter into these sorrowful mysteries on this first Sunday of Lent, let us come with, with infinite confidence, with full confidence, in Jesus Christ crucified, the power of God and the wisdom of God. And we give thanks for the healing, let's say the initial healing of Paul, Paul in the United Kingdom, who we prayed for a week or two ago, and who uh, has had some very significant steps along the path to healing. And so thanks be to God. And let's continue praying for him and all those who are ill, for all those babies in the womb, including the little baby of Camille, who's a member of our Rosary Crusade, and her baby who, God willing, will see the light of day in May in Our Lady's Month, that the baby might be preserved healthy for baptism and to serve our Lord upon the earth. And then for a mother who was just called from this world and for the four children that she leaves behind, and for all those most in need of God's assistance, including many private intentions that have been submitted and for all the secret, the, all the intentions you hold in the secret of your heart right now. Saint Joseph, terror of demons, cast thy solemn gaze upon the devil and all his minions, and protect us with thy mighty staff. Thou fled through the night to avoid the devil's wicked designs. Now with the power of God smite the demons as they flee from thee. Grant special protection, we pray, for children, fathers, mothers, families, and the dying. By God's grace, no demon dares approach while thou art near. So we beg of thee, St. Joseph, always be near to us. Amen. St. Joseph, the terror of demons, pray for us. Eternal Father, we offer thee the most precious blood of thy divine Son, Jesus, in union with the Masses said throughout the world today, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my family. Amen.
the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Ghost, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Ghost, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first sorrowful mystery, the agony in the garden, we ask for the fruit of the mystery, fervor in prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The second sorrowful mystery, the scourging at the pillar. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, a spirit of mortification. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The third sorrowful mystery, the crowning with thorns. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, moral courage.
Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, patience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the crucifixion and death of our Savior upon the cross. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, forgiveness of injuries, and a spirit of self-sacrifice. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those in most need of thine mercy. O Jesus, I choose to live this day for love of thee, for the conversion of sinners, and in reparation for the sins committed against the Immaculate Heart of Mary. Amen. Mm -hmm. Ave Regina Celorum, Ave Domina Angelorum, Salve Radix, Salve Porta, Ex qua mundo lux est torta, Gaude virgo gloriosa, Super omnes pecigosa, Vale go valde decora, E pro nobis Christum ex ora. Digna de me laudare te Virgo Sacrata, da mi qui virtutem contra ostes tumus. Let us pray. Grant unto us, O merciful God, a defense against our weakness, that we who remember the Holy Mother of God, by the help of her intercession, may rise from our iniquities through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. And may Almighty God, through the intercession of the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary, pour His graces upon each one of your families. Benedictio Dei Omnipotentis, Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti, Descendat super vos et maniat semper. Amen. Thank you very much for being part of this Our Lady of Fatima Rosary Crusade. If you have a few more minutes, I'll read for you the readings for today and share with you three foods, three spiritual foods that the readings point to that our Lord wants to offer us, or I should say, well, He does offer us, and He wants us to go ahead and eat, um, eat abundantly of these spiritual foods during the grace-filled season of Lent. From the second letter of St. Paul, the Apostle to the Corinthians. Brethren, we exhort you that you receive not the grace of God in vain. For he saith, In an acceptable time have I heard thee, and in the day of salvation have I helped thee. Behold, now is the acceptable time. Behold, now is the day of salvation. Giving no offense to any man, that our ministry be not blamed. But in all things let us exhibit ourselves as the ministers of God, in much patience, in tribulations, in necessities, in distresses, in stripes, in prisons, in seditions, in labors, in watchings, in fastings, in chastity, in knowledge, in long suffering, in sweetness, in the Holy Ghost, in charity unfeigned, in the word of truth, in the power of God, by the armor of justice on the right hand and on the left, by honor and dishonor, by evil report and good report, as deceivers and yet true, as unknown and yet known, as dying and behold we live, as chastised and not killed, 
as sorrowful yet always rejoicing, as needy yet enriching many, as having nothing and possessing all things. From the continuation of the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. At that time, Jesus was led by the Spirit into the desert to be tempted by the devil. And when he had fasted 40 days and 40 nights, afterwards he was hungry. And the tempter coming said to him, If thou be the Son of God, command that these stones be made bread. Who answered and said, It is written, Not in bread alone doth man live, but in every word that proceedeth from the mouth of God. Then the devil took him up into the holy city, and set him upon the pinnacle of the temple, and said to him, If thou be the Son of God, cast thyself down, for it is written that he hath given his angels charge over thee, and in their hands shall they bear thee up, lest perhaps thou dash thy foot against a stone. Jesus said to him, It is written again, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God. Again the devil took him up into a very high mountain and showed him all the kingdoms of the world and the glory of them and said to them, All these will I give thee, if falling down thou wilt adore me. Then Jesus said to him, Be gone, Satan, for it is written, The Lord thy God shalt thou adore and him only shalt thou serve. Then the devil left him, and behold, angels came and ministered to him. There are three, three sets of three that were given today. Or I should say we're given Wednesday, today, and then in Scripture. So on Ash Wednesday, we're given the three great efforts that God wants us, um, summarizes or highlights these three efforts. Our Lord in the Gospel speaks of fasting, so fasting and not letting your fasting be seen on the outside, almsgiving, that is works of charity, as much as possible in a hidden way, and then prayer. So that's three great pillars of sacrifice during Lent. Then today's Gospel, we're given three temptations of our Lord, and the first one of those is that it has to do with the temptation to turn stones into bread. And instead the Lord responds, man does not live on every word that comes, does not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes forth from the mouth of God. And that points to the third set of three, which is the three foods. Several years ago in uh, France, I remember hearing a priest preach on the three great foods that our Lord speaks of in the gospel. And I think it's helpful to recall those so that you might feed yourself, feed your family in abundance with those three foods. So what are they during this Lent? Because if we're called to sacrifice in other ways, we're called to, you could say, to eat even more uh, of good food for our souls. The first is the Word of God. So he says, look, we, even more than you need bread, you need the Word of God. You need the very teaching of God. And that is true in a very particular way with sacred scripture, especially with the Gospels, especially with the New Testament. But the Word of God was confided to the Church. Our Lord didn't write anything. He gave it to the Apostles uh, to be preached, and then gradually it was written down, and is divinely inspired and fallible. But whenever the Church hands on, for example, when children learn the Baltimore Catechism, they're receiving the Word of God in its essential parts, being handed on to children. Even though the formulas are, are concise language, it's not Scripture usually. But that's the Church feeding us with the Word of God. So uh, the good catechism, also even the, the writings and teachings of the saints, in a sense, is handing on to us God's teaching. So that's the first food, is the very teaching of God, the Word of God. Secondly, if you look at the second temptation, where he says, he brings him up to this pinnacle of the temple, and says, cast yourself down, um, and, and the angels will bear you up, and the Lord responds, thou shalt not tempt 
the Lord thy God. That is, you, 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 he's not going to ask his father for something that's not his father's will. He's not going to choose and say, I sort of try to make his father do something extraordinary. He's going to submit to his father's plan. And that has to do with the food which our Lord references in the Gospel of St. John, speaking with a Samaritan woman, or after speaking with her, the apostles come back and they offer him food, and he says, I'm, I'm not hungry. And, well, they said, did someone else give him food? And he says, nope, I have a food which you do not know. My, my food is to do the will of him who sent me. So doing the Father's will is the second food. The more that each day you try to do the Father's will, it actually, it might cost you, but it strengthens you, it nourishes you, it makes you much more capable of, of being so much stronger and capable of, uh, of anything, of whatever God asks of you. And then third, the third temptation is when the devil tries to get, uh, tempts the Lord to worship the devil, which of course he's not going to do. And he says, thou shalt worship only the Lord thy God. And that has to do with the food of the Holy Eucharist, when, which is the, the, the pinnacle of our worship of God, is in the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass, which whereas the Church teaches, the Lord's sacrifice is rendered present upon the altar, uh, the Holy Sacrifice of Calvary. We are we're really present at the foot of Calvary every time we're at the Holy Mass. And that's in the Gospel of St. John again, the Lord says, that uh, he says, unless you eat my flesh and drink my blood, he speaks of his, his body as the Holy Eucharist. And so there are the three foods. Eat in abundance during this Lent of the Word of God. And again, realizing that's handed on also through the Church, so through good catechism or the teaching of the saints and so forth. Then through the Father's will, and that can be done all throughout. You can, you can be eating spiritually all throughout the day by saying yes to the Father's will, saying no to the inclination to deviate from that. And then thirdly, by prayer and the worship of God, especially through the Holy Eucharist. So God bless all of you. I hope that you are able to eat in abundance of those things and also to have the appropriate rest and relaxation and food on this Sunday, the first Sunday of Lent. And I look forward to praying the Holy Rosary with you tomorrow. God bless you. 